I'm going to make a video response to Kit K's remote control battery, the A23 or T3A 12 volt battery as seen here from Radio Shack. And in his video, he showed that there are eight button cell batteries. This is a redo from the other video where I goofed up and said his name wrong, so sorry about that, Kip. Let's take it apart, shall we? Let's just a little bit like that. There we go. Now someone mentioned in the comments that I'm using a fingernail clipper. This is an old set. It's dull as hell. Lake L, Venice, Florida. Venice, Florida. As you can see, they basically suck. See? All beat up. So, <clears throat> I use them to hack the batteries up, like that. So please use caution if you do this. This time I'm going to be using needle nose, as well as the clippers. Be very cautious when you do this. See, there's one of the end caps. Second thought, maybe not. You can see there's some of the little batteries. This paper sleeve has another end cap. And then another battery. And then that thing just came out. So there you go. That is everything that is in one of those little batteries. So Kip K, you're right. I'm not saying you're wrong, but I just thought I'd do this too. And count, that's like some sort of spacer. That goes on the top. And then these are pretty, probably an end cap as well. Paper shield to prevent shorts. And there's the outer casing. And there's the little batteries inside. And I probably said this in my other video. See if I can get you a number on these things. Nope, they just say button cell. But I think that they're the same as in the other video. It's a LR92 or something, I can't remember. Well, anyways, thanks for watching. And I hope you like this video. And you know what to do.